This right here is my the best win I ever got from a claw machine. This Pac-Man plushie right here. Look at him. Don't you just love him? I, I, I've had this set for I think a decade now. Oh my gosh. Do you believe this? He's going to be in live action. For a while back, I talked about how a Mega Man in live action would work and how it couldn't work but with pac-man i have no idea how it could work this article um that was posted on the highwood reporter by mia galupo a live action pac-man movie in the works from wayfarer a movie studio bandai namco exclusive so let me give you a bit of a rundown so right here the project will be based on an original idea from chuck williams who was also the associate producer on the Sonic movie of Light Beam Entertainment. Blondi, Ma Monogargi, and Andrew Goloroff will produce on behalf of Wayfair Studios. Williams and Tony Block will produce on behalf of Light Beam Wayfair, which recently announced a $125 million investment from Saruth for expanded production growth was behind Disney Plus feature clouds. Its, up, uh, its upcoming state includes football drama The Senior and the coming of age comedy The Empire Waste. I don't know what that one is, but it sounds good. But now with Pac-Man, like I said, with Mega Man and Sonic, I'd say it's simple. it was simpler with those two because with them, they... It, uh, for them in live action, they have more interactions with humans. While with Pac-Man, he doesn't really have any interactions with like actual people because he's he's more of a cartoon character, similar to how Mario is in a way where he doesn't normally um, interact with humans outside from Toads. The only time he ever had an actual interaction with humans or actual people was. In pixels but his role in that movie was as a video game character that was brought to life by aliens to pl play in an actual pac-man against adam sandler in ghost car so i don't think that's how they're gonna use him in the movie personally i feel that pac-man would work best in a ghostbusters type of setting where you would have all the ghosts just roaming a city and then you would come to this world to take care of all of them similar to how Tails came to Earth in Sonic 2 to help Sonic take, take down Eggman that, that I'd say would just be the most simple and easy plot for a Pac-Man The way I'd see this working out is if they try and tell the story of Pac-Man World where you have his family be kidnapped and he has to try to save him but he gets sent to the human world and he just gets comfy living there and then finally the ghosts start to show up and so do his family so that he can finally take him down and save his family in the process. I'd say in a similar way to how Smurfs were where they're brought to York and they started getting cozy there for a bit and then finally the real threat arrives and then his family gets involved and they're able to fight all together. Another way I'd see it working is if they use the storyline from Ghost Adventures and <laughs> and that's how I would think it would work in live action but that's gonna be it so let me know what you think a, a Pac-Man live action would work, look like and what other video game movie should get a live action. So, thank you all for watching. Be sure to sub, sub for more content. I, I shall be live probably tonight, and I shall see you all in the next one. Have a good one. Wait, where's my... Where's my plushie?